You are most welcome friends on GLC Top 50 IS online platform. If you want to download, if you want to join the uh, online platform of GLC Top 50, you can download the GLC IS Top 50 uh, application from the Play Store in Android version and can enroll in the online batches where you can join the separate batches for Hindi medium and English medium, both medium are available here and also different types of test series available at, at the online platform and daily current affair weekly current affair and monthly current affair also available at the online platform if you want to join the online yeah, enroll uh, offline batches you can go over go and door and join the offline batches in the institutes institute now the simple interest it was uh, the topic in previous lecture but uh, uh, it was the basic to, uh, lecture and now the basic to moderate that type of question asked in examination we uh, all will cover in this lecture and practice question you also have to practice with me and uh, write down and note down all the notes that you prepared by me now continue the question a sum of money put at 11% per annum amount to rupees 4491 in 2 years and 3 months. What will be it amount in 3 years at the same rate? First of all, we have to calculate. Uh, first of all, we have to take a manner in which we have to write the solution in examination. So, first of all, solution. And then we have to write what is given. First of all, we, I will change the uh, ink. Now, first of all, what is given? Given that rate percentage, that means rate is equals to 11% per annum and amount rupees, amount it will become amount 4491 in how much time, how many time? In time, 2 years and 3 months, that is 2 and 3 by 12, 3 ones are 3, 3 4 are 12, that is 2, 1 by 4, 4, 2 are 8 and 9 by 4 years, that is 9 by 4 years, it is time. What will it amount in 3 years? So first of all we have to calculate the basic principal and the interest and then we reach to the basic principal of 3 years, uh, sorry basic uh, amount yeah, amount to become in 3 years so now we know that SI is equals to first of all we uh, let principal be x then SI is equals to a simple interest is equals to principal into rate into time upon 100 we put value together here yeah, uh, substitute the value P is equals to x we let the principal is x and rate is 11% and time is 9 by 4 years and upon 100 that is SI that means a what and is equals to 99 upon 400 99 upon 400x it will become simple interest now again It is the simple interest and we have to calculate the x so in this question it is given that this is the uh, this is the amount n so from here si what will si si will when we subtract principal from the amount that means 4491 minus x principal will deduct from there so it will become 4491x minus x is equals to 99 by 100x so now we will separate x 4491 is equals to 99 by 400x plus x 4491 is equals to when we take LCM it will 
400 and 499x 499x then we separate x is equals to and it will be deduct for uh, when we cancel out 499 ones are 9 times so 9 multiply by 400 so value of x that is principal become 3600 rupees now question asks what will be it amount in 3 years at the same rate that means first of all we have to calculate simple interest and second that is at the uh, 3 years at the time 3 years so principal is equals to 3600 rate same that means 11% and time 3 years upon 100 it will be the uh, calculation at yeah, calculate at t is equals to 3 years it will give 11 3 is a 33 that means 36 into 33 when we calculate 36 multiply by 33 3 6 is a 18 3 3 is a 9 and 1 10 into 1 0 8 it means 8 8 1 1 11 8 8 it will become simple interest that is 1188 so si2 is a new amount that is amount new amount will become 3600 plus 1188 that is 8874 hence new amount will be rupees 4788 in 3 years it is our answer now now next question at what rate percent per annum will rupees 3600 amount to rupees 4734 in 3 years what is question asked question asked that what is rate percent it want to calculate the rate percent per annum when principal is 3600 amount to rupees that means 36 jo principal hai wo hamara kitna ban 4734 rupees in how many times 3 and half years so solution given that principal is equals to 3600 amount and time is equals to 3 and half year that is 3 to the 6 and 7 by 2 years amount is equals to 4737 so si will be si will be 4737 minus 36 that is amount minus principal so 7 sorry it is 4 so 34 we have to clear it 4734 that is 4734 rupees amount so simple interest will when we deduct principal from the amount so 4734 minus 3600 it will give 4 minus 0 4 3 minus 0 3 and 7 minus 6 that is 1 and 4 minus 3 that is 1 4 minus 3 it will give 1 that means what it means 1134 it is simple interest so now again we know that yeah, since simple interest interest is equals to P into R into T upon 100 on substituting value 
1134 is equals to principal is 3600 and rate we have to calculate rate and time is equals to 7 by 2 years upon 100 7 by 2 into 100 then we cancel out it it will become and separate our same side 1134 remain there and 2 that is in divide it goes to multiply 7 that is in multiply it goes to divide and 36 that is multiply it will goes to divide 2 1s are 2 2 18 7 1s are 7 7 1s are 7 4 43 6 are 1 6 uh, 7 6 are 42 1 remain and 162 then R is equals to 162 divided by 18 it means R is equals to 18 1s are 18 18 9s are 162 that means 9 percent hence the rate percent rate r is equals to 9 percent per annum this is our answer clear is it clear now next question if rupees 640 amount to rupees 768 in two years and six months, what will be uh, what will rupees 850 amount to be in three years at same rate percent per annum? Question one to ask: If rupees 640 जो है तो two years and six months में कितना भी हो जाता है 768, so at the same rate, है ना? We have to calculate first in this uh, what's to rate and then it wants to again apply this rate to at the principal 850 uh, what will become amount in 3 year uh, at the same rate so first of all we have to calculate the rate now solution gives we yeah, are given that principal is equal to 640 and time gives 2 years 6 months that is 2 6 by 12 6 on the 6 is 2 the 12 2 to the 4 and 5 is equals to 5 by 2 years and principal sorry amount is equals to 768 so SI will become uh, amount minus principal that is 768 minus 640 is it was to 128 rupees so si is it clear 128 rupees so now we again know since si is equals to principal into rate into time upon 100 and we have and we have what SI is equals to 128 is equals to principal. What is principal? Principal is 640. What is rate? Rate we have to calculate and time. What is time? Time is 5 by 2 years upon 100. Then we will calculate it 0 can cancel by 0. 5 and the 5, 5 to the 10. Now we have to separate R there and 128 this side upon. 64 into 2 into 2 that is 4 so 4 1s are 4 4 1s are 4 and 4 for the 16 that is r is equals to r is equals to 128 by 16 that means 8 percent rate is equals to 8 percent now again he want uh, it uh, the question want to calculate the amount of principal 850 in 3 years so now simple interest we will put the value 850 into same rate that means 8% into time for 3 year upon 100 it will be 0 cancel by 0 5 2 za and 70 5 za that means 2 1 za and 2 4 za it will give 17 into 4 3 za 
well that means simple interest will be 12 7s are 84 12 1s are 12 and 8 204 204 so simple interest will be 204 rupees now amount amount will principal plus si is equal to principal what is principal we have 640 plus si 204 so it will give 842 rupees hence this is our answer clear now again a sum of money become 8 by 5 of itself in 5 years how much time in how many time in 5 years a certain rate of simple interest find the rate of interest so we have to calculate the rate of interest so first of all solution what is given given that given that time is equals to 5 years and uh, again uh, we have to start from here let's suppose first of all हम इसको क्या मान लेंगे कि जो हमारा principal है x suppose कर लेंगे उसको that is let the principal be let the principal principal be x now according to question amount is equals to 8 by 5 times of x that is 8 by 5 times of x x is a principal and time is equals to 5 year again simple interest is equals to amount minus principal so amount is 8 by 5x minus principal x that is 8x minus 5x upon 5 is equals to 3 by 5x so si is equals to 3 by 5x and principal is x and we have to calculate r now again we know that si is equals to si is equals to principal into rate into time upon 100 so si the value of si what is 3 by 5 3 by 5 x is the value of si and principal what is principal principal we let x and rate we have to calculate in time time is given that 5 year upon 100 now we will separate the x here this side and 3 by 5 100 is in divide so uh, 5 ones are 5 or 20 so 20 goes to multiply and x goes to divide and x is remain here so x can uh, cancel by x and 5 ones are 5 5 fours are 20 and 3 fours are 12 so rate percentage will be 12 percent answer hence rate is equals to 12 percent per annum okay is it clear now next a sum of money lent at simple interest amount rupees 4745 in 3 years and rupees 5475 in 5 years another type of question that can be asked in examination so learn it very carefully and if any doubt please watch the video again and solve this question so question 1 to say that a sum of money lent at simple interest amount this in 3 years and rupees is in 5 years so let solution let principal b let principal b x now according to question now the si now si 8 yeah, after sorry yeah, we have calculate amount we have, uh, we have given now 
amount after amount after 3 years is equals to 4745 and amount after 5 years is equals to 5475 that means it is the difference here difference of both means SI a simple interest earned on the basic principal in 2 years so in 3 years amount be this and after 5 years that means after uh, 3 years after 2 years it becomes 5475 it means in total 5 years it becomes 5473 so SI of 2 years uh, simple interest of 2 years is equals to 5475 minus 4745 is equals to 5 minus 5 when we deduct the amount after 3 year from amount after 5 year it will give the simple interest of uh, interest of 2 years so when we deduct 5 from 5 it gives 0 4 from 7 it gives 3 7 from 4 it gives 7 and 0 so 730 is the interest of 2 years so interest of 1 year it will be 730 by 2 is equals to 365 and SI of 3 year why we calculate 3 year because we have the amount after 3 years this then we will deduct the interest of 3 years from this amount it will give our principal so now simple interest of 3 years again I repeat my golden words I have or we have the uh, interest of 1 year 365 and we calculate it for 3 years that means triple a, we will do triple of this simple interest that means we have to calculate the simple interest of 3 year and when we deduct this amount they, uh, this interest from the total amount after 3 year it will give the principal because the amount after 3 year will the sum of principal and simple interest so we, when we deduct simple interest it will give when we deduct the uh, simple interest it will give uh, uh, amount so SI of 3 year after 3 years yeah 3 years 365 into 3 that means 3 fives are 5 uh, 15 3 6 are 18 and 1 19 3 3 is a 9 9 and 1 10 that is rupees 1095 now principal is equals to amount minus SI after 3 years that is amount is 4745 minus SI 1095 it will give 5 minus 5 0 4 minus 9 that is 5 7 minus 1 that is 6 and 4 minus 1 that is 3 3 6 5 0 is the principal and it again wants uh, wants to the question again want to calculate the rate percentage so we will calculate it at a uh, time at one year huh? so SI SI is equals to principal 3650 into rate percentage we have to calculate and time time is one year upon 100 8 T is equals to one year so SI here 0 will be uh, cancelled by 0 and here SI is 365 now 365 multiplied by 10 is equals to 365 into R 365 cancelled by 365 and R is equals to 10% hence 
we have calculated both the things here that rate is equals to 10% and principal is equals to 365 rupees this is our answer this question clearly i hope this question will uh, is clearly understood by you and if any problem in, uh, in understanding please watch this video again a replay from that starting of that question and again watch it now the next question that <coughs> divide rupees 300 into two parts huh? we have to divide 300 rupees in two parts part one and part two such that the simple interest on the first part simple interest on the first part and for four year and eight percent per annum is equal to that is simple interest at first part is equal to the simple interest of second part is, is equal so in this type of question we have first of all we uh, we have let the principal and then re, uh, first part and then first part re, uh, deduct from the second part it will give second part uh, when we deduct the first part from the principal, it will be the second part and we have to calculate SI first for first part and SI second for second part and we have to equate the both SI first and SI second, it will be the value of X, that is the first part and second part. So, now we will start to calculate solution let first part b x then second will 3000 minus x this is second part according to question for first part for first part SI1 is equals to principal that is principal what is principal x into rate what is rate 8% into time 4 years what is time 4 years upon 100 that is 32x by 100 it is SI first and now for second part now for second part, SI2 is equals to 300 minus X, that is the principal into what is rate percent? Rate percent is 9 percent and time is 2 here upon 100. It will give 9 to the 18, 18 3 the 54,000 minus 18x upon 100 it, this will say si2 now according to question we have to equate the si first is equals to si second now we will remove this Now, according to question, what is one to question? That like SI from the first part is equal to SI from the second part, both are equal. So, we have put the value here 32 upon 100 x is equal to 54 triple zero minus 18 x upon 100. 100 cancel by 100 so it will give 32x plus 18x is equals to 54000 13 and 32 and 18 will give 40 and 50x 50x is equals to 54000 x is equals to 54000 upon 50 that means 0 cancel by 0 5 ones are 5, uh, then 5 eights are 14 0. That is, first part is 1080. Now, first part 
x is equals to 1 0 at 0 and second part 3000 minus x that is 3000 minus 1080 is equals to 1920 rupees 9920 hence our answer okay is it clear if any doubt please replay the video and watch again now at last you will have to prepare all the question that is given is practice session so question number first second third fourth all four question we have to practice here the answer of this question is given here and match the answer answer from the answer sheet and at last question number five said that question asked the mpvc means in different years we have to take the previous question paper and find out the question that is asked with uh, in this uh, year with from the topic simple interest we have to solve and boost up our confidence towards the MPPC examinations now at last i want to thank you all of you to watch the video and at last i want to again welcome at the glc top 50 is glc top 50 platform online platform to join the batches for MPPC in both the medium for hindi medium and english medium both batch, uh, both the medium uh, batches for the, both the medium are separated so i hope you will join uh, again i want to thank you for watching the video okay. thanks